got Brecky. It looks like a little smile. And then we got the oats over there. Shameless plug. Huge and stuff. And you guys can probably tell by the video. I'm so excited to say that as of today, episode one, Road to Tahoe prep, because you guys, as of today, Friday, May 29th, the gyms here in Nevada have opened. Yes, I am so excited. You guys can tell by the smile on my face. I'm so freaking stoked. Yeah, guys, this is this is crazy. I'm going to eat breakfast real quick because I'm really hungry. But like I said, we have one cup of egg whites, two whole eggs, four ounces of ground beef, 93% lean. And then we got one cup of oats, 80 grams with one banana. And there's some stevia drops and cinnamon in there. I'm going to eat this real quick. And then I'll talk to you guys afterwards about everything that's going on. All right, so just finished up breakfast, meal number one. But yeah, you guys, gyms are open. I'm so excited. Bogey's excited too. This is like, I didn't think I'd see this day for a while because there's still a lot of gyms and places closed across America. But yeah, gyms are open. It's great. And we will be 10 weeks out as of tomorrow, May 30th. I turned 20 in like a week and a half on June 8th. Yeah, dude, no more teen years. It's gonna be crazy. But prep has begun. Well, it's, I've technically been in prep, kinda. Um, I'm not like prep conditioned though. Like my conditioning is still good. It's just, I'm not like super peeled like I was when I was four or five weeks out. So like I said, we'll be 10 weeks out tomorrow. Um, so my coach wanted me to still grow during this quarantine, which we did a little bit. Um, he just didn't want to keep my conditioning so low to the point where I wouldn't be able to put on muscle. Um, but it's go time. Green light has been given. Um, we're not going to focus so much on conditioning right now. He really wants to focus on bringing up my lower back and putting more lines into my legs. But obviously, getting closer to the show, that's when we'll really nail the conditioning and hit conditioning hard, which I'm assuming we'll probably start doing around seven, six weeks out. Just really starting to hammer everything down. But yeah, guys, I'm super excited. Tahoe is going to be insane this year. Um, I did Tahoe last year. That was the last show I did. So we'll do comparisons this year from last year's Tahoe show to this year. See the improvements I made because that's going to be a big difference. I'm super stoked, super excited. Right now I'm going to go shower and then I will see you guys soon. Probably for meal number two, which will be our pre-workout meal. I almost spilled that. Anyways, you guys, got meal number two right here. As you can see, egg whites, almond milk, Gerber rice, and then one scoop of Isoject, which is the protein that I use from Evagen. Flavor right here is banana mango. This one's not my favorite flavor. I'll admit it. It's, uh, it's a little bit of an odd taste, but it's still good. It was on sale too, so that's why I kind of got it. But the best flavor so far that I've had is the mocha ibuccino that one is amazing guys the protein powder is really thin um the natural one is a little bit thicker but just a normal ice eject the powder is super fine super thin so it mixes really easily um, i also have the pumpkin spice liver upstairs which that one is amazing as well but i'm going to sip on this and this is our pre-workout shake this is our meal number two um it's just because we're working out at noon today and it's currently 11 13 so i gotta go upstairs and get ready and i'll see you guys when we get to the gym it's weird saying that now like going to the gym but yeah see you guys at stimulus
right, guys. So, first day back at Stimulus at the gym. It was amazing. It was so good. Had a really good back session. Um, I noticed, too, so on my rack pulls in the beginning, it was sitting, so it only looks like there was a plate on each side, so that's why I moved it. So when I was in my rack pulls, it looked like it was only one plate on each side. That's why I moved it to the side so you guys can see like how much I was doing. But I started with the plate for warm-up. I went 135 to 25, and then I started my working sets at 315. So I did 315 for 15, 405 for 15, 495 for 15, and then I did 495 again and hit 14. Um, I realized halfway through, I'm like, oh, they can't see all the plates. So that's why I moved it. But first day back, so things are... Like I said, I wasn't working out with anyone too, um, so I have anyone to record for me. But hopefully, the majority of my workouts now I will be lifting with someone, um, so that'll be easier to get footage for you guys. Because I feel like it's kind of like ghetto, not like having someone film for me and me just setting the camera up. Not ghetto, but it's like it's not as good as if someone were to be filming for me. So, with that being said, uh, the majority. But what? The majority of my workouts, I'll be lifting with someone, probably just one person. Um, but I'll have them film my sets for me so that it's more pleasing for you guys to watch. But I'll show you guys what my pre workout stack today was. Today, I did one scoop of EVP 3D in the peach rings flavor from Evagen. This is their non stim uh, pre workout, but it has all the pump, focus, everything you need in there. And then I also did one scoop of the Carnogen Plus Caffeine. So it's 100 milligrams of caffeine in one scoop. This is the new mango lemonade flavor. That was amazing with the peach rings. Because the peach rings is kind of sour. So I kind of helped balance it out. But you guys, there is something special in here. I'm excited to show you guys. So I'm going to open it up and show you what's inside. It's pre-workout. I found out about this through Lex Little, but you guys will just see. You'll see in a second. Oh, yes. Dark energy, baby. Look at that. So, for you guys that don't know what dark energy is, who found out about this pre-workout through Lex Little. I looked it up, right? I looked it up. I'm like, hmm, I wonder what's in it. What makes it so good? There's a, there's a lot of stuff in it, you guys. Um, I'll, I'll just go ahead and show you. Yeah, uh, yeah I'll just I'll show you what it is. So I've been going on a pre-workout break, uh, so I haven't really had that much caffeine. But if you guys look... I don't know why this is auto not auto-focusing right now. It's really fucking pissing me off. I really... Like, this camera is so amazing and nice, but the auto-focus is shit. Anyways. I'll just read it to you guys. So... 30 servings, right? 30 servings. First of all, it's 400 milligrams of caffeine. I've been on a caffeine break, like I said. That's why I'm doing the non stim pre-workout. 400 milligrams of caffeine. 750 megs of DMAE. And then, uh, here's the good part. 200 milligrams of DMHA. And 60 milligrams of DMAA. If you guys don't know... DMA is an illegal substance that can't be put into pre-workouts anymore. But this company somehow can sell it in their pre-workout. So I'll be trying this tomorrow with shoulders. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to film tomorrow. But when I film next, I'll definitely be taking that pre-workout. Anyways, so let's go eat. Alright, so we got our meal number four. Post-workout meal. We have one cup of rice, eight ounces of chicken, and three ounces of broccoli. Uh, we're still on two cheat meals a week right now, so we get one cheat meal after legs and one cheat meal after back. So my next cheat meal will be Monday after back, which I'll probably record that day. Actually, no, I'll record it Friday because Friday, next Friday, will be the Road to Tahoe episode two. So I'll record next Friday's cheat meal, which will probably be sushi with the boys, which will be super fun. But... I'm gonna get down on this, eat this, and I will see you guys here shortly. Eight ounces of chicken, eight ounces of sweet potato, eight asparagus spears, you guys. And uh, diet's probably gonna be changing soon, because like I said, I will be 10 weeks out as of tomorrow, and we are gonna be starting cardio back up soon, which I'm actually not too upset about. 
I don't mind doing the cardio. It's just some days I don't want to do it. But yeah, you guys, I'm going to eat this up, get some work done on my phone. Um, guys, I'm so excited for this series. I'm so excited that the gyms are back open. I'm excited to start prep again. Like, I'm really fucking excited. Um, I will be doing a physique update this upcoming week. Um, I won't be doing it in this video, but the next video, you guys will get a physique update. So I'm very excited to show the improvements that I made. I'm not as lean right now, obviously, as I was before. But we'll be back to that point in a couple weeks. Give it four or five weeks and we'll be peeled to the bone again. But I'm going to eat this, you guys. And I will see you for meal number six. And then I'll end off the video after that. See you in a little bit. Alright guys, as you can see, this is my final meal of the day. I forgot to film meal 6 earlier, and I said I was going to end the video off after that, but since I forgot to film it, I'm ending the video after this meal right now. I'm flipping tired. It's 10 o'clock right now. It's 10.03. 10.04. Yeah guys, so I have one scoop of ice eject in here, and then there's one scoop of glutamine, a cup of egg whites, and a cup of almond milk. But yeah, you guys, that's my normal nighttime shake. Anyways, you guys, I hope you all enjoyed the video today. Like I said, um, I will be, whenever I'm working out with someone, the video is always going to be more interesting because I'll have someone filming my workout for me, which, special surprise for you guys, Colin is going to be here from June 7th to the 10th. My birthday is on June 8th, so Colin's going to be up here for my birthday, so that's going to be a fun video to film. Um, I will definitely be filming that day um, because we're going to get a workout in together. We're going to have sushi that day because we got a cheat meal on my birthday. And yeah, it's just going to be all around a good time. Um, this series is going to be really fun. There's going to be 11 episodes because this is a 10 week out, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. So yeah, there'll be so there'll be ten episodes from week ten to week to one week out, and then the eleventh episode. Jesus Christ, I can't fucking speak. Once it comes around peak week, I'm probably gonna do multiple videos that week. So I'll hit the one week out mark, and then I'm probably gonna film on Friday the day before show, and then Saturday the day of show, and Sunday the day after. So I'm gonna be filming those three days. I'll be filming. Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, um, which those will all be separate vlogs. So Thursday, or not Thursday, Friday will be the day before, which will be all the registration, the tanning, all that stuff. But, so that'll be part one. So the show day vlog will be three parts. So I'll do, I'm going to be doing one video a week. I'm just going to explain this right now to you guys. If you don't want to listen to it, it'll be the end of the video. So just click off now. But listen, please. Um, so... I'll do one video a week, obviously, for the Tahoe prep. This is the 10 week out video. It'll go all the way down to one week out. And then, like I said, once we get to the week of show, I'll hit my one week out, I'll throw the video up. I'll film the Friday before show, which will be part one, which like I said, it's registration, tanning, um, all the carb up and stuff. Uh, Saturday, the day of show, which will be part two, which I'll have Colin filming that because Colin will be up there. And he's good with video, so he'll be filming that. And then I'll film Sunday the day after, which will be part three, which will be like a cheat day. Just enjoy myself, eat whatever I want. So the whole series itself will be 10 episodes just for the prep. And then the actual show day part will be three parts. So I'll just give you guys a little impact. But I hope you all enjoyed the video. Remember to leave a like, comment, and subscribe, of course. Get your boy to 200 subscribers. And I'll see you all in the next episode. Peace. Yeah. Yeah.